दादाजी आई नो डैड वर्क एज एन इंजीनियर इन अ कंपनी वॉट वर यू डूइंग वेन यू व यंग आई वॉज द पोस्ट मास्टर इन अ पोस्ट ऑफिस really what was your dad doing he was a farmer okay dada ji why do people work people work to earn money because everyone needs money to buy food clothes tv refrigerator computer car and so many other things we use at home or we need what are the different jobs done by the people people do different jobs like agriculture animal husbandry fishery mining industry trade transport entertainment etc These jobs are known as occupations. Dada ji, will you tell me more about occupations? Surely, I have all such pictures on my laptop about occupation. Let's take a look at them. There are four main occupations: agriculture, mining, fishery and animal husbandry okay have you ever seen a farmer at work yes i have he plows and prepares the soil for growing crops this occupation of cultivating the soil and growing crops is called agriculture Man started agriculture many years ago. We get grains like rice, wheat and pulses, fruits, flowers, vegetables and oil seeds in the market. All these are grown by the farmer. Agriculture depends on soil, water, climate and the sun. There are two agricultural seasons. they are kharif season and rabi season kharif season means rainy season rabi season means winter season what is grown in the kharif season rice jowar bajra moong and cotton are cultivated during the rainy season so they are called kharif crops what are rabi crops wheat gram and sunflower are cultivated in the winter season therefore they are called rabi crops in some places rainfall is more in such places farming is done with the help of rain water alone such farming is called rain fed farming or girayati farming in some places rainfall is less in such places farming is done with the help of water supplied from wells and rivers supplying water for agriculture in this way is called irrigation such farming is known as irrigated farming or bagayati farming oh i didn't know that agriculture included so much of activity tell me about mining as an occupation now Let me tell you about mining as an occupation. We use kerosene to burn a stove. We use petrol to run vehicles. We get kerosene and petrol from crude oil. 
crude oil is naturally available in the earth. We obtain it from oil wells. We use articles made of iron, steel and copper. These metals are obtained from iron ore, limestone, manganese and copper ore. These ores are dug out from the earth. What is mining actually? The occupation of digging out rocks and soil, that is ores and mineral oil from the earth is called mining. Is fishing also an occupation? Yes, beta. It is. Fishermen catch fish in the seas, lakes and rivers. Catching fish on a large scale is called fishery. Fishing is done mostly along the sea coasts. As fish is perishable, Fisheries require cold storage facilities to store fish and vehicles for carrying it from the seashore to the market. Fish and other marine wealth are used as food as well as for preparing fertilizers and medicines. Nowadays, fish are bred in lakes and ponds. This occupation is known as Pisciculture, that is, fish farming. The next occupation is animal husbandry. Rhea, can you name some domestic animals? Cats, dogs, cows, buffaloes, bullocks, horses, donkeys, goats, and sheep are the domestic animals. Out of these animals, cats and dogs are kept as pet animals. Animals like cows, buffaloes, bullocks, horses, donkeys, goats and sheep are kept for milk, meat, wool, manure and leather. This occupation of keeping animals is called animal husbandry. It also includes poultry, that is, keeping ducks and chicken. These birds give us meat and eggs. Pigs are also reared for meat. Animals like bullocks, buffaloes, Horses and donkeys are used for farm work and to carry loads. Dadaji, what work do the people in Mumbai do? Now, let's discuss the occupations of the people living in Greater Mumbai. Brihan Mumbai is a well-developed area. There are many shopping centers companies and factories. Earlier, there were rice fields and coconut trees at this place. The rice fields and coconut trees have been destroyed for the construction of houses and industries. These days, cultivation of vegetables is done on a small level along the railway tracks. We can find stone quarries in Ghatkopar, Vikroli, Bhandup and Goregaon. These stones are used for construction. Milk production is done in dairies in places like Jogeshwari and Goregaon. Buffaloes are kept in large sheds. Big dairy projects are located at Worli and Kurla areas. Milk is processed to make butter, ghee, shrikhand, paneer, etc. Greater Mumbai has a long coastline on its three sides. Fishing is done along the coastal areas 
and in the creeks along the Arabian Sea. Trawlers are used for deep sea fishing. Mackerel, king mackerel, pomfrets and prawns are the fish caught here. This occupation is mainly done by the coolies. They weave fishing nets. They also apply salt and dry the fish for selling them in the market. I don't like fish. It smells a lot. Yes, but it has a lot of proteins. There are oil wells located in the sea near Mumbai. Mineral oil is obtained from these oil wells. There are thousands of small and big industries. Because of the variety of occupations available in Greater Mumbai, many people go there for living. The people of Greater Mumbai are really lucky. They are both lucky and unlucky. Unlucky? But how? Because of huge population and many industries, a huge amount of garbage is collected every day. Garbage has become a major problem in Greater Mumbai. How do they dispose it? It is dumped in places like Borivali, Gurai Creek, Devnar and Chembur. It must be stinking in those places. Exactly. So, these days, manure is produced out of the garbage by using scientific techniques. What is that scientific way? <laughs> the way of converting garbage into manure is known as vermiculture. Vermiculture reduces pollution of the environment.